I just don't understand why you and Mum always have to freak out. It's because you're our little girl. You are just now, but you're still our little girl. You don't have to be tough all the time. No one is. Yeah, but if it wasn't for this stupid condition, I'd be in the army now, wouldn't I? Yeah. And you would have made a top soldier. But I'm glad you didn't get in. I need you around me, Nance. I don't want you to go anywhere. OK? Have you farted? Where you been? Well, you got legs. Why didn't you come and find me? I wonder. I've come to pack. Oh. Yeah, that's right. You're leaving because you don't really care about family, do you? Dad gave this to you, did he? Hmm? Called him. None of your business. Is that where you're heading? Shouldn't you go and see him because he's your son? Not because you've got nowhere else to go? I haven't rang him. He's playing you, Dad. He knows exactly what buttons to press. He's jealous. Save his psychology for someone who's got more than one GCSE, yeah? He hates the fact his three kids are together and he's not. What did he say? Nothing that I didn't know already. What did he say to you? He said that I would never be part of your family. He said that I'd always be an outsider. And do you know what? For once, he wasn't talking rubbish. Well, you are part of this family, and we do want you to stay. On your terms? At arm's length, nothing too permanent? Because I'm too much of a risk, scarn on Mick. But I don't blame you. I wouldn't trust me either. Tell what you think. I didn't fight hard enough. I watched them take you away, and I didn't fight. Fighting would have made absolutely no difference. The only person I should feel guilty about letting us down his dad. I've never blamed you, and nor has Tina. We are your family. We always have and always will be. It's not every family, is it? Because Linda is going to make you choose. We all know where this is going. I can't promise you that I can change Linda's mind. I will try. What I can promise you is that whether you're a licensee or not, you are one of us. So just let me talk to her one more time. You just give me one more chance. Please. I know what she's asking. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> because she's scared. <laughs> Surely scared. She's scared that she hasn't got nothing. Dad's got into her nuts. It's made her feel like an outsider. It's made her feel like she's not wanted. So we just hand our business over. What's wrong with a bunch of flowers? She's never really belonged, you know? I don't want her to feel like that anymore. You're asking too much. If you're not going to think of our family, fine. But I am. Please don't make me choose. Shouldn't be a choice. Do you know what? All this, none of it matters if you're not happy or saying? I'm saying we walk. I'm saying we just, we can't start again somewhere else. We're good at that. I will always choose you, Elle. Always. <laughs>